Hi guys, today I'm gonna to talk about five of the best coats uh, for winter in Canada. So uh, I have this selection of coats that I like and I think one this is the coats that one of the best for you to use for every day. I'll start with um, this simple one and lighter one. This is um, Arthrix Magnus Parker. It's, a, it's their new model that they just in, in introduced this year. It's very light, it's very comfy and uh, very easy to, to wear with your coat, with your uh, jeans, with your um, pants, chinos, whatever you, you're wearing, even the suits. I think it, you can put it on and you can wear it to, to your work and to your office and uh, even for a walk. Uh, what's good about this, this coat? Um, I wouldn't recommend it for like really big minus. Uh, I, I would say you can wear this coat up to minus five uh, Celsius. They have um, a really thin insulation here. It's like about 80 grams, I would say. And but the good thing about this coat, they made with um, uh, Gore-Tex material, so it's waterproof and windproof, which is really great. So. Um, it's really comfy and really nice. As you can see, it it gives you really nice and classy look, so you can wear it anywhere you want. Second coat would be um, uh, longer and more warmer coat from a uh, brand that makes ski wear mostly. It's Descent, uh, Japanese brand. It's a um, coat that I, I'm wearing for about maybe three years already and I really happy with this coat. It's not that classy, it's not that nice as the Arthrix, uh, I mean in terms of look, but it's really comfy and nice to wear. So you still can wear it with your, with your coat, your sport coat, you still can wear it with your pants, jeans, uh, chinos, whatever you're wearing. You can wear it even to slopes if you're skiing. I'm not sure if it's gonna be too uh, comfy to ski with, but it's really warm. I was wearing this coat up to, I think, minus 15, I would say, and it was pretty pretty comfortable. Uh, it's uh, windproof and waterproof as well. And they use Dermizax here. It's a different, um, uh, different brand than uh, Gore-Tex, but it's still really nice. And I think they almost like similar. So uh, this is another coat that you can consider. I know they might, may not produce this one or like uh, this particular uh, style of coat, but they always have this longer version of their skiing coat. So you can check it out on their website and um, I would recommend this for sure. It also has um, synthetic insulation inside. It's not down here, but it's really warm, but pretty warm up to 15 as, as I was saying. And, but you have this um, option to detach the insulation part and then you will have your like raincoat or something that you can wear during uh, uh, spring or uh, autumn. Next one would be this uh, coat from Pearl Jumpers. Uh, it's a Marcus model, they call it Marcus, I don't know why. Uh, it's heavier than coats that they Show you before but it made with down so it's a uh, real goose down here and it has this like kind of ballistic material like outside here but it's still pretty warm it's pretty uh, comfortable to wear it's more casual model so you can wear it on your weekends uh, or if you have your work that you can wear casual stuff you can wear it too i wear this coat for up to 15 minus 15 and i i was wearing shirt my t-shirt shirt this coat and i was pretty comfortable it's also windproof i'm not sure about waterproof i didn't test it yet so i wouldn't recommend it to go like onto the rain or really heavy like a wet snow but in terms of windproof it's really great and uh, i would recommend this coat the only minus here is um it's not that long so if you want something longer that you can wear with your jeans without any like underpants uh you have to go with something longer so next one, warmer one, would be another Arthrix, really light, 
our face in our house. Uh, it's another coat, it's warmer, it's made with down. Uh, really good quality down. Um, it's, it's called um, Arthrix Thermo. As you see, it has this, again, this uh, like simple, minimal, classic look. Uh, and you can wear it to your work, like everyday coat. One of the best for me, for now. I wear it to, to the office and uh, I wear it with my jackets, I wear it with my suits and I'm really comfortable with this. It's also made with Gore-Tex, a uh, little bit different kind of Gore-Tex than previous one, but still waterproof, windproof, so you don't have to worry about anything when you're wearing this coat. The only thing here is, again, not that long that you might expect, so you have to understand that you have you need some underpants if you're walking around like in the forest or something, but for you to to get to work or to have some like walk like 10, 15, 20 minutes, it would be enough for you and would be pretty comfortable. Uh, like the minuses here, I would say they don't have like bigger uh, pockets here. You can barely like uh, you can put some small uh, wallet probably here. Uh, and you can put your iPhone or, or any other phone that you use but if you have like this bigger phone like I have iPhone Max it's not it, it won't fit here it barely could fit here In general I really like this coat and I think the price they're asking for this coat is really fair and so you can uh, if, and if you find it on, on sale which I found in sale it's even better uh, always look for sale they have this color here you can adjust it with the strings here and it would be more comfortable even more comfortable uh, they have a nice hood here very warm and uh, if you go like this you good to go even somewhere in the mountains so i would recommend this spot for everyday use it's i think one of the best options for you to buy and another coat uh, is warm the most warmer one that I have for now is this Woolrich, Woolrich John Rich and Brother, not like simple Woolrich, so it's more high-end kind of Woolrich coat. Uh, they uh, well known for their Arctic parka, but they have some minus with this Arctic parka. Uh, if you tried it, you you might know it, but if you're not, you you're not familiar with this, they have their zip goes somewhere up to here. Oh, in this coat it folds differently, it's a laminated uh, parka which they made with zipper up to here, so it cover your neck and you stay very warm. It has this coyote fur here, it made with a um, really good quality down uh, and it's very light, very light parka, so it's really incredibly light and i would recommend it if you live somewhere like north northern part of canada or uh, in northern states or somewhere where it's very cold you can wear it anytime and it's really nice and warm uh, the only thing about this coat that i don't like it's uh, i understand it's short but uh, they would if they would make some strings like this that you can do some adjustments here uh, would be much better because otherwise when you're walking you can feel some like flow, wind flow around the knees which is would be not comfortable so you have to wear some underpants if you're going for like longer walk with this coat for big minuses. So that's pretty much all I want to say about these five coats that we that I own. I'm really happy with all of them. They all uh, serve their own purpose but if I will go let's say with one or two I would pr probably would have my two Arteryx and uh, and this uh, Woolrich for like really colder uh, weather so that's all for today thank you for watching and see you next time